Hello, welcome to another episode of Row the Show. We have six games left in the 2023 season, regular season. We are one game behind the wild card. Astros and White Sox are tied. Second part, the second um, place in the wild card. We have six games left, three against Houston and three against Oakland away games. We definitely need to win win the series against Houston so we can at least have a shot at the wild card. And I am leading off today, and Corey Kluber's on the mound for the Angels and Jose McGurdy for the Astros. Do your best to win this game. So just about set. So in now for the Angels, number seven. Leading off tonight for the Angels, the shortstop, number seven. The pitch. Swing and a miss. And that's how and this, this series begins. Stands. That one down the line. And that's just foul. Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> that one misses in the dirt. The wind of the pitch. Swing and a miss. Curveball in the dirt. Kloecki down to first with it. Got him. One away on the strikeout. And now We're leading us to one. Number seven. He is quite an number athlete. Seven. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports, too. Center field. Drop. Touch is okay. That's a hit. And now they'll Here we have go. Let's the go. With two away. Well, that was an important at-bat in this game, so a great job there stepping up to the challenge. Didn't try to do too much with it, just a really controlled simple on, swing. Fletcher. We don't see a whole lot of that these days with guys trying to launch and hit home runs, but sometimes you got to shorten up just like that. Next yeah. offering way off the plate. Good speed on the base pass. He handles the bat very well. I wouldn't be surprised if the skipper puts on some type of hit and run or a run and hit. The 3-1. Runner going, on going. the goal. 3-1. Oh, he couldn't come okay. up with it. No, that sets up a really big at bat in this game. Come on. Everyone the come on, Mike. He gets really locked in. The 1-2. Okay, go, go, go. In to score from third. It's come back. Well, we're starting over again, all tied up. Everyone's trying to elevate the ball in today's game, but if you can hit a ball that hard, oh, the ground, it's going to find some holes. And here it comes. Hit weakly on the of ground. Of course, of Out course. Collects it. Fires over to first. And that'll do it. So two down, and the batter will be the shortstop. Shea Whitcomb. Not shortstop. On the ground to short. That's a hit. And that turns the lineup over. Just one of those seen eye base hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over. Jose Altuve up next for the Astros. Yeah, okay. we Rounded out good. his first time. Okay. Tied up here in the early Altuve. going. Out to short. In plenty of time. Okay. First. Yeah, it's already got to get out. <laughs> and that Little speedy is that. guy. Little speedy man. The power I needed to score. Together. I don't know why. Well, we knew back. he was going to be a stud just coming up, making his way through the minor leagues, and quickly at this level, an impact player. Walking right me. Okay. Bit of strategy here. They issue the intentional walk, and that'll set up a force play at any base. Oh, you're too scared of pitching me, huh? That walk. I don't think it's a big deal. Come on, Fletcher. If you pitch to the previous hitter with the power he has, he can hit a home run. I think it was a calculated walk. We'll see how it pays off here. Two outs. And a swing. There we go. Drive at a right field. Base hit. One run is in. Now two runs score. It's four two. Here we go. Well, Here we go. Opportunity to drive in some runs, and he comes pay. to break the tie. That was maybe even a little off the plate, but no problem getting the barrel to it. Man, he does such a nice job, and that's what you're supposed to do with the pitch in that location. Next pitch is popped up. Bregman is under it, and that is the third out of the inning. 
Okay, we have a 4-2 lead. Good. Hopefully we can keep the lead. Altuve, Leon, and McCormick. Man at first with one gone. Here's McCormick, a speed threat. Chaz Altuve. Altuve. Gosh, he's probably going to get a stealing run. He's definitely looking for a big swing of the bat right here. Try to close that gap. But, you know, at the very least, if you can find a way to here. manufacture that run from first, it feels like it's really... Plenty of time to get Altuve and him. Okay. And it's a double play to end the inning. You'd think Altuve would be on the run. <laughs> okay, 5-2. Back five to, to the two. top of the Angels lineup. And next for L.A., number seven. Number seven. Hit streak stays alive. Layoff, okay. Come well, on, Crawford boxes, Crawford boxes. Crawford boxes. And that yeah. one is off the wall. Nice triple. The relay to the plate, not in time. He nice triple. Scores. It's six two. Picks himself up. RBI triple. RBI. To me, it's just a really controlled ballot swing. He wasn't trying to do too much. With yeah, just he got this game in the bag. Let's uh, make sure we don't screw it up. <laughs> You're watching me on the Eddie Deals. Light drive. Okay. Oh my go. Seven to two. A couple of hits in a row for him here. Solid swing from start to end. So they're down to their final out. Here's Kevin Plawecki. Plawecki. The catcher. Kevin Plawecki. We can do this. We got it. On the ground. Throw to first. That's it. Time. Final this game. One is over. We win. And the Angels take game one of the series on the road. It's always nice to grab the opener of a series. You come into a yes, new ballpark, and just sometimes things aren't as comfortable as what you've been used to. The mound doesn't look straight. The background isn't what you like, but they didn't let any of those and things off distract the Crawford them. Boxes. Fact, it looked like they were playing a home game. Excellent job to set the tone for this series. Our final line score tonight. Okay, return to the clubhouse. Seven Got walked. <laughs> Intentional walk. Got to go a little more disciplined at the plate. <laughs> uh, we're both um, one game behind. White Sox are on a winning streak, five-game winning streak. We're tied with the Astros, one game behind. Magic number's five. We pretty much got to win every game. Archer is our starting pitcher. Set now. Here's the shortstop at the plate. Number seven. Tonight for the Batting left-handed. Batting left-handed. Number seven. Luis Garcia. Dirt. Here comes a pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One gone here. Number seven will hit next. Singing, you can't ask for anything more. This guy checks all the boxes offensively. He is the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start at game time. It starts in the afternoon the way he prepares and gets ready for the ball game. I tell you what, his teammates feed off of the leadership that he shows on and off the field. Lifted in the air. Right go. Uh, not going to go. It. And there's one away. Back here in Houston. Oh, uh, they were getting killed. Again. Now it's the Angels' leadoff man, number seven. Take get on. In striking distance, but have some work to do. On this three ball count, down in the ball game, you've got to be very selective. Take very your selective. Give it to you. Swings and misses. Damn it. So he's gotten deep into this game. Well, no hits. <laughs> now it's the DH, Pedro Leon. The Must be my first Pedro. defensive play. Damn it. And the right hander deals. Up the middle. On to first. One up, one down. One you got to get on the board. Here's Alex Bregman. <laughs> Getting kind of late. Alex Bregman. Hit on the ground, might be two. Do it, do it, second. do it. Do on it. the first, okay. double play, and that's the inning. we got to get on the board. Two hits in the whole game.
again and it remains three and two. Left field. Damn it. Up against the wall. And makes Very it. Very close to the Crawford boxes. Gone. And stepping in for the Astros. Can't Pedro get a break. Leon. Can't get a break. <laughs> Pedro. Leon. Leon. At the belt and fight. Being shut down. Roll to short. Could be two. Feed to second. That's wow. one. Double play. Okay. What a twin killing to end the inning. You can tie the series. A couple of games a year to see your team win at home. There's just something special about that. Good job by these guys to get it done for the hometown fans. Man, we got nothing. We had to win this game this for Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB the show. Thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chambi. Talk to you soon. OK, I guess we'll just finish the series. First the All set to go. So in now for the Angels, number seven. Leading off the afternoon for the Angels, the shortstop, number seven. <laughs> Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One away. Man at second with one away. And next to hit for Houston, Jose Altuve. Good contact yes. guy, good defender. Jose Altuve. Got one, right here. one and two now. Altuve waits. Tapped on the ground softly to short. Uh oh. Throw what am I doing, second. man? Safe at first as they can't make the. I wasn't paying attention now there. The shortstop Shay <laughs> Whitcomb. Two for six so far in the series. Probably wouldn't have gotten him nice anyways. Here. Good slow roller is a fast runner. Does that change anything, Chris? Uh, especially shit. for the hitters. Absolutely. You feel so much more comfortable at the plate. You're not worried about. So get oh, jammed on it. fastball. <laughs> been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to. Well, oh. plays made there, Wouldn't and that retires the side. With a traditional double-pitting stretch. One down. One, one out, down. runner at second. At the plate is the Astros catcher, Kevin Plawecki. Now batting. And Boog, I'd say he's due. Kevin. Plawecki. Oh, Okay. This okay. one popped up. Number seven yeah, 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 under this it, one. Take it, take it. Take it. Two down. Man at second here with two away. And the batter will be the shortstop, Shea Whitcomb. The pitch. Out to short. Zips it across. That ends the frame. The bat's been dead. That's dead. These guys really needed to win this game today. Dead, they pushed man. them over the top to win the series, which is great. But when you go on the road, going into some hostile territory, you want to have a lot of confidence, and you want to be feeling really good about how you're playing, dead, as well man. as to your left and your right, your teammates, that they're on track as well. And your final 3-1. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. Okay, I guess we're screwed. What should we do? Just send the rest of the season and just be done with it? Because we're probably done, man. We're two behind now. We needed these wins. I guess we got to sweep Oakland, and hopefully the Astros and the White Sox lose both the games. I guess we got to sweep Oakland. <laughs> we got swept by Oakland. We we lose, and one of the teams wins. It's over for us, man. I may just want to send the rest of the game, send the rest of the season. Like, no, we're not out yet. We got to win every game, and those teams got to lose every game, and we just do that. You know what? I think I'll just send the rest of the season. Sim the season. Sim through dates. How did we do? Angels have finished this season 85 and 77. Unfortunately, it wasn't good enough to make the postseason. Better luck next season. Because I knew, I mean, I knew we couldn't win. We won two games. We lost one game. And I'm the only one left in the clubhouse. So sad. <laughs>
Where did everybody go? Okay, let's see what happens. Okay, so White Sox won three in a row. So we were done anyways. So what's the point of playing those games? We're going to Oakland, which is a <laughs> the last dive bar. So I don't think I wanted to play there. Okay, so anyways, I want to thank you for watching. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video, share this video, and I'll see you in the next video. And I'm going to start another season. Probably do one more season before the 2023 games comes out. So anyways, I'll talk to you soon.